going on guys my name is shane and today we're gonna do a little bit of a vlog style for the beginning of the video and then later on we're gonna do a lingerie try on haul hopefully we get lucky um i went to forever 21 the other day and i will say it was quite bare um i was a little shocked I think most of their products for Valentine's Day was online. But a lot of these companies will drop collections like for Valentine's Day, for example. That happens to be one of my favorite holidays. I know not too many people love it, but I do. So I really love taking advantage. My main goal today is to see what is at um, Victoria's Secret. I know they have had to drop something for Valentine's Day. Um, maybe we'll check out Charlotte Russe, um, maybe even Windsor. We'll see what's there. Hopefully we get lucky. And then when we get home, I'll show you what we get as well as a try on. I will have my photographer with me today. So hopefully we'll get a lot of photos and videos done today for the upcoming holiday. We found some stuff. Uh, Victoria's Secret had quite a big selection of um, Valentine's Day stuff. Is no surprise there. And Charlotte Ruth surprisingly had a few items as well. So I picked up a few of each. I think we're gonna start with Charlotte Ruth first because it's more of like loungewear stuff. I did get a pink pair of sweatpants, but they're pink pair of sweatpants. I'm not gonna bother showing them today. <laughs> Thank you. My photographer came in for me. Yeah, see? Pink sweatpants, so it's not lying. They're super comfortable and they're on, um, I don't know if they're on sale, but they're like $10 right now. And I, I'm posting this a day or two after, so that sale should still be going on. So go check that out. I used to love Charlotte Russe when oh, I went to Ulta too. I used to love Charlotte Russe as a team. So I'm gonna pull out the stuff and show you guys and then we will just sort of try it on. So the first thing, well, I'll get this out of the way, you guys, know why i need these they have a buy one accessory or even perfume buy one and get another for a dollar so that's why i got two i was picking up one anyway another one for a buck the first thing i got i like oversized graphic tees um if i'm not going out or if I, i'm also a delivery driver full time outside of modeling so if i'm just running a couple errands i like to be comfortable and i'm not in heels all day so i like just cute little t-shirts that kind of express my personality or my interests. I like Hello Kitty. I think she's very girly. I got it a little bit oversized because I like wearing them as long shirts with a pair of stockings. Also, quick side note about like the lighting and the big open space. We are redoing our bedroom. Um, <clears throat> we actually just had furniture delivered today. We just laid down the flooring. So after this video, that's what I'm going to be doing. But here is the first piece. So again, I wanted a, it a little bit longer. So it's a perfect size. Throw on a pair of, um, oh, the shoes I'm wearing too. While we're at it, because I'm showing uh, that I would wear like white stockings with this. Or even pink stockings would be cute for Valentine's Day. I don't know. You could dress it up. The shoes though, they have... They had a bunch of sandals on sale for like $5 and I saw a nude pair. I was really bummed out though. They had a size seven and a size eight, both the right pair of shoe. So I couldn't get it. <laughs> Charlotte Russe, I kind of got the lounge wear. So I got a pajama set. We'll throw this on as well, but it's a pair of shorts and then a tank. <laughs> All right, I'm hoping they might be willing to help me out, but I don't know how this happened because they were both on the same hanger, but the bottoms are a, a literally a large. Um, and, and, and the funniest part about this, the best part about this is this doesn't, um, adjust, which I don't like. I will, I won't lie. It was really affordable, but I need adjustable straps especially in the situation where I could make it work. I had the straps pulled, but they don't. So I'm gonna possibly go back there this week and be like, hey, um, you can see that the tag says large and the top says extra small. So I don't know what to do about that. And hopefully they would even have these in an extra small. 
but I thought they were really cute considering how much makeup I do. It says makeup, what does it say? Wake up, wake up makeup. I thought that was really adorable. I want to wear that in like an upcoming makeup tutorial, but yeah, I'm a little bit bummed out about the shorts because they were really cute. They have the little, um, li oh, are they lipsticks? Yeah, lipstick tubes and then the little coffee cups, which ironically, I don't drink coffee, but whatever, I can't wear them anyway, so. <laughs> I guess we will move on to the Victoria's Secret stuff, which I got the, um, the three for, no, five for 30 panty sale. So I guess I'll show you those. And then I think I got three sets of lingerie. Um, but I'll keep, I'll keep the top on. I'll show you guys the bottom. I was trying my hardest to find, again, Valentine's Day, like hearts or roses or even kisses. And I really, I, I didn't get very lucky in the panties um, for my size, at least. I need an extra small. And these are all extra small, but they're not all Valentine's Day, which is fine. I got three neutral colors and then two that are Valentine's Day. So I guess we'll start with the neutrals. You guys are going to have to please bear with me. First of all, I lost a little bit of my footage yesterday. I don't know. I went to go edit it. And for some reason, the first thing I got from Victoria's Secret went missing. So I'm back the next day. I'm going to film this one part and then we're going to jump right back into what we filmed yesterday. I figured we would start with the gray ones because they do match the top that I was wearing. So they're just basic thongs, nothing special, but I do like when they have that sale. You can get a few of them. Then we have black. I figured you can't go wrong with a black pair. I got neutral and you're actually gonna see me wear them in the lingerie try on part. So I like these neutral panties and the cover ups. Uh, that way I'm able to show you guys the lingerie with a little bit more modesty where you can't see everything. <laughs> this is perfect because it's very small and stringy. It'll allow the garment to really show through. I did manage to snag this black and white striped pair with little pink hearts on it so good we have at least one that's fitting the theme I was going for. This last one was also part of the bundle but it's the only one that is a little bit of a different style. It's still the thong style but the straps are a little bit thicker and it also has some rhinestones in the front so anyway back to the rest of the video. Your hair, yeah like that while you're right there hold that. Move your hair so I can see the t-shirt. Chin high. You own it. Okay, next. I pulled out all my lingerie pieces, so we have three of them. I try to go with the Valentine's theme of like pinks, reds. Um, so we have two pinks and we have one black and red one. We have like a crap. A crap? <laughs> we have a piece of shit from... The first piece I'm going to show you today is the two-piece matching hot pink set. It's like a mini corset top and then it has the matching panty. The panty has such a cute detail. Well, you can see it on the corset top as well. Maybe not as well. Maybe. Do you see the hearts? That's all hearts in the mesh. Oh my gosh, we got to try this. All right, here she is. Oh my god. It's... It is so beautiful. Victoria's Secret never fails. The top is not tied or anything. It does have like the peekaboo underneath the chest here. Now I do have the nude thong on, obviously for a little bit of modesty. I will say though, look at the back for a second. What would you have put there? What would you have put there? A little heart. That's the only thing I'm a little disappointed. It doesn't have, there's an opportunity missed to put a little heart right there. I'm just saying. Anyway, the rest of it is absolutely gorgeous. Actually, this allows it you to see the pattern really, really, really well on the bottom. Same sort of pattern on the top. In my light, you can see it shining off of some of the fabric. So that is in real life. It has a little bit of shine to it. A lot of us will struggle with our sides and tops like this can <laughs> sort of squeeze you in and have everything else sort of pop out on the side. So I do have some other options to show you guys if this is not your cup of tea. However, if it is, I think it's a beautiful choice and definitely, definitely one I would recommend and I was very happy to pick up. Oh, sorry. Let's no, see. no, no. Just hold that. That's it. 
I want to do all of the pink lingerie first, so we're going to do the next one. I have a few things to talk about this one, and you can probably see my issue right away. Um, <laughs> I am not a blessed girl in the top. <laughs> So I need straps, I need adjustables, and surprisingly, when I went to go and untie this at the shoulder to make it tighter, you can't. It's um, just sewn on there, so there is no adjusting the strap. If I could just make it like an inch or two shorter, just to hike up my ladies a little bit, like that, by like that much, it would be perfect. Unfortunately, it's not going to work for my body type. I'm so bummed out because it's so cute and it's so different than anything that I have. It reminded me of like a little apron and because I love baking so much, that's what drew me to it immediately. I do wish they had it in red originally. Um, so it kind of works out that it's not going to work for me. I'm just going to return it. It does have the strappy back. So the back just straps like a normal bra and then this tied around the waist. But again, it's not gonna work for me, that's okay. It's not gonna work for everybody, um, but it is super cute if you do have maybe a larger top and can fill this out really well, get it, because I think it's adorable, but unfortunately, not for me. Last outfit is the red and black one I was talking about. So th this one was, um, <clears throat> you had a splurge on this top. It was, it, was it worth it? I don't know. You tell me. Um, it has this gorgeous, like, I don't even know what this material is. It's just fabric roses. Um, of course, you can see the mesh going all around. I will say you can feel the quality in this top. It is very, very thick. Even the clasps in the back when I was fastening them. Um, it's similar to the bras that you would get at Victoria's Secret, how they just, they feel like a really good quality, at least to me. I ended up pairing this top with matching black panties. I'm hoping you can see a little bit of the lace pattern there up against the nude bottoms as well. But this one, however, they didn't fail me on. They actually have adjust adjustable straps, which I'm very excited about. And it does get really, really, really tight. This isn't an extra small. Everything that I showed you today is in an extra small in case you need size comparison. But this one, honestly, I would even maybe go up a size. That's how uh, small it's running. It's squishing my gut. <laughs> I'm gonna take a couple last minute photos of this one. I'm actually gonna do a second photo shoot with this particular outfit in the morning, but I wanna do my brown hair. I wanna do like a nice, <laughs> I wanna do like a nice updo, um, maybe like a nice red lip, get some close ups of the top. <laughs> We're just gonna snap a couple photos right now and then again, both of them. Yeah, let's see the rose, you baby. Talk. You talked in the first Oh, one. did I? I did love you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> there we go. That was very cute. Um, so we're just, we're just going to get a couple photos tonight. <laughs> and then we're going to do a whole nother one with this uh, top in the morning. So check me out on Instagram if you aren't on there already. I have a modeling page. <laughs> and I have one for my man channel too. <laughs> okay. <laughs> right. Thank you guys so much for watching. <laughs> you can talk and have pictures. Thank you guys too. so. Thank you guys so much for watching. <laughs> if you enjoyed, please go ahead and leave a thumbs up. You guys have also helped me. <laughs> I'm not gonna watch. I'm not even shooting. Look, oh, look, you're look. Not even <laughs> I agree. I'm not even shooting every <laughs> time, damn it. <laughs> so good. Throw it up here. You always get the most uh, fantastic photos of me. You stay classy, San Diego. <laughs> I was trying to say that you guys have helped my channel grow so much over the past like couple weeks or so. It's been so fast. So thank you all for the new support. I hope you look forward to. I hope you look forward to what? <laughs> what are we looking forward to? I look. I hope you look forward to more videos in the future, more unboxings, more try-ons. Please let me know what you want. It's not always going to be lingerie, um, but we're going to try a whole bunch this upcoming year, and I'm really, really excited to get started.